Howdy, y'all. Mr. Kazi coming to you from beautiful Atascacita, Texas. And today I want to talk to you about mole fraction. So, get out your calculator and let's get started. Uh, you should know moles. You should know molarity. You should know concentrations. And you should know how to do stoichiometry. Now, don't panic if you don't know how to do any of these. Just go to my YouTube channel slash Mr. Causey and check out uh, the videos that you need to uh, fix this shortage. You can also uh, go down to my description, click on some of the links that I've supplied. So what is mole fraction? Mole fraction is a type of concentration. It is similar to molarity or moality. Now, if you're not sure about moality, you can go right up here and check out some of my videos on molarity and molality. Mole fraction is the number of moles of solute per moles of solution. It could also be the number of moles of solvent per moles of solution. It's very similar to that of a percentage problem, except that we're comparing moles of the parts to moles of the whole. So mole solute divided by the moles of solution equals mole fraction of the solute. And moles of solvent per moles of solution is the mole fraction of solvent. Let's try one. A solution is prepared by mixing 100 grams of water and 100 grams of ethanol. Now we're going to assume in this situation that water is the solvent and ethanol is the solute. So we're going to determine the mole fraction of each substance. So first change the grams of solvent and solute to moles. And we do this dividing by the molar mass. Now if you're not sure about molar mass, uh, go to my YouTube channel or check out some of the videos up here in the right hand corner and make sure you know how to do molar mass. So 100 grams of water divided by the molar mass of water will uh, give us 5.549 moles of water. Now let's do the same for ethanol. 100 grams of ethanol divided by 46.08 grams per mole and we'll get uh, 2.107 moles of ethanol. Now we have the moles of each of these. Add the moles of solvent and solute for the total moles of solution. So 5.54 moles of water plus 2.107 moles of ethanol and that'll give us 7.656 moles of solution. Now we have the moles of solvent, the moles of solute, and the moles of solution. We're ready to calculate mole fraction. Now remember that moles of solute per mole of solution will give us the mole fraction of solute. So 2.107 moles of ethanol divided by 7.656 moles of solution will equal 0.2752. Now notice the units canceled out. Now remember, moles uh, of solvent per moles of solution will give us the mole fraction of the solvent. So to the blackboard, 5.549 moles of water divided by the total moles of solution will give us a mole fraction of 0.7248. So thank you for watching. Uh, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and check out some of my other videos. And most of all, don't forget to subscribe. Happy Ions, y'all.